Hey my little picturinos and welcome back to another Cuffs Monday. Happy Monday. Ready to start your week on a good note and today we have a challenge and I want you guys to have a go at doing this challenge as well. So this is a suggestion by you guys. One sim, four outfit looks challenge. That's a mouthful. One sim, four looks challenge. That's better. And what the idea is, is you take one sim, uh, you have their original looks. The first one's kind of done for you. I'm taking Faith. I asked on Twitter who you guys thought I should do. I saw Phoenix on there. I saw Summer on there. I saw a lot of Lilith on there, but I I use Lilith quite a lot in challenges and I just gave Faith a little bit of a remake over so I thought we would do Faith this challenge also because she has such a casual look I thought it would be quite fun to see her in a few different looks as well so this is the first outfit we have it's Faith's casual look and then I've got three more Faithikins lined up along the bottom there to try three more looks and here are the looks I am gonna give a go so the first one I'm kind of excited to do with her because it's so different to regular Faith we have Instagram body version of Faith I'm gonna give a go so it's like this kind of outfit and a very specific specific makeup type. Then we have, I'm kind of like looking either like e-girl or like 2020 goth style. So like a little bit more of a like modern goth kind of vibes. Let me know what you guys think. Maybe even a little bit more slash e-girl kind of vibe. And then finally, I'm going to go for modern pinup vibes. So it's like this uh, rockabilly, kind of like the pinup look, but usually with a little bit more darker makeup and a little bit, sometimes with tattoos as well. And like bandana wrapped around the head, like just that kind of cute vibey look. I thought we would go ahead and give that a go as well. So if you guys are excited for this video, please don't forget to give it a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss any more videos, including Cast Monday videos. And as I said, I want you guys to give this a go as well. So please, please, please play along. Get one of your sims and tweet me or Instagram me uh, screenshots of them with each look. So their first look and then the three makeovers that you gave them. So this is Faith's casual look. Uh, I've tried to make it like look like so the only makeup she has on is she has the eye flicks. And then I guess maybe a little bit of pink on her cheeks, but basically you can still see all the freckles. For her lips, I've gone for what is just meant to look like, it's meant to just look like lips. It's not meant to look like lipstick or anything. It's just kind of like regular lips with a little bit of regular texture on there. She's low makeup. She's very casual. She is basically a surgeon. Or I think in the end, she ended up chief of staff. She ended up like chief of surgery or chief of staff basically in a hospital. So she's smart. She just basically throws her hair up and goes straight on to work. But if she wasn't a surgeon, what kind of looks would she have? So one thing I'm going to warn you guys is for this, because it's so hard to get styles with um, ginger hair. Ginger hair just doesn't seem like a lot of, a lot of people just don't make the style for ginger hair. I'm going to relax her hair for this video and might go for just some different looks, some blondes, some brunettes, maybe even some black hair. And I think it's quite fun because it will mix up her look even more. So first of all, let's go for a baddie look. So I'm gonna take her hair off just for now. I think her eyebrows, her eyebrows might be okay as they are now. Although I'm kind of thinking they might need to be a little bit heavier and have more of the gradient. Cause like, this is like the Instagram baddie look right here. The other thing is I think we're gonna end up losing her freckles just because the makeup is heavier. I know some people dot them back on, but if you wear heavy foundation, you tend to lose your freckles. So for this look, I don't think she's gonna have freckles. And as much as it pains me to do this, cause you guys know I freaking love freckles, but uh, heavy foundation, your freckles are gonna get hidden unfortunately. Also, I think the Instagram body look, you kind of go for like more bronzed skin. I'm kind of tempted to give her just like a little bit of a tan as well. So there we go, she's a little bit more bronzed now. And then it's the glowy highlighter on the top, isn't it? I say that literally having it on. <laughs> you guys wanted to see her like full body, so I want to deliver that for you guys. Matte lipstick as well. I'm gonna basically use this girl here as a guide. She's looking pretty baddie to me so far. I actually find it so weird seeing like Faith with heavy makeup. Like it's just really weird. I want to get a bit darker on her eyebrows. Okay, I think that's pretty body makeup so far. I was like almost tempted to do brown eyes because I, I don't know, I, I like, I think the makeup looks really nice with brown eyes, but your eye color wouldn't change, I guess. Okay, looking good, looking good. Now for the hair, like this kind of vibes, although they do have that in red. It's more like red, red. Oh, I got ginger here. I got like auburn here. That could work. That's pretty body. I could do it behind her, but we're getting a bit of issues with her, uh, her head shape. I just changed the hairline on it because it looked a little bit weird. There we go, okay. Looking good. And then it's the clothes, isn't it? Or like these. I always get advertised like dresses like that. Like on my Instagram feed, they pop up like all the time. Like those quite silky, but also super slim fit dresses. I've tried on literally everything, literally everything. I kind of think this, and then with this, the tight skirt, I think that could look quite cute like this, but maybe like that color. I gave her a bag as well. <laughs> and then some shoes, some big old heels that I could never walk in, but I wish I could. I need to learn to walk in heels, honestly, like before my wedding day. Not gonna lie, or else that could get real embarrassing. And then I'm kind of vibing like a choker style necklace. I've got one that's like um a choker, and then it's got like a line going down. Okay, nails. You need your nails, love. Oh my gosh, I'm missing nails. <laughs> like I went for like a neutral color right before the lockdown, 
and I'm really glad I did because they're so grown out. You can't really tell so much, so that's good. I don't really have bracelets. I need to download some. Maybe I'll just give her a phone instead. Gold matching the outfit more. Let's go gold. And I think this is pretty close. I feel like this is as close as we're gonna get. It's she's so faith that in my head she still doesn't really look like a body. She just she just looks like faith, but a little bit more glam. But I've tried. I feel like this is as body as I can make her. Let me know what you guys think. I, I don't think I want to put like big hoop earrings on her, but I don't think you're gonna be able to see them. It's fine, whatever. Okay, first look, Instagram body is done. She's got a phone out ready to take some Instagram pics of her look. Let me know what you guys think. I went, I kept her hair red. I just went a little bit darker with it. And yeah, Instagram body look. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I'm not gonna change her body for any of this, but if I was, I'd, like it's the very like hourglassy shape, which honestly with a lot of people on Instagram, I'm not sure if it's actually their shape. I think there's a bit of Instagram versus reality going on there, especially with this Instagram body look in particular. But there we go, first look. Next up, uh, I'm gonna go for the rockabilly one because I'm kind of excited to try that. And again, this is, it's pretty heavy makeup. Like, look at here, it's like red lips, heavy like top eye, but not necessarily like loads of eye, eye shadow. I think I'm gonna use this girl here as like inspiration and this girl here as well. Okay, so I'm gonna start by instantly putting some pretty red lips on just so we can like get the look going straight away and more heavy eye flicks as well. It, lo it looks, it's such pretty makeup. I, I try and do eye flicks every day. I'm so bad at them. I wish I was better at them, but I'm just not. And I'm also kind of tempted to go for blonde hair for this one, just so that we have like darker red, blonde, and then for ego, goth. But I think I'm gonna go more goth. I'm obviously gonna go black hair on her just because I want to see how she looks. So let's go a little bit more blondie with this one. Plus I think with the blonde hair, it'll make the makeup stand out more. Okay, I feel like that makeup's, you guys have, might need to correct me, but I feel like it's pretty spot on. And since we're going for like modern day rockabilly, kind of tempted to, maybe they're a little bit big actually. Kind of some of these vibes along there as well. But I could always do them white so they're not quite as intense. I don't know, let's just leave them like that for now. Let's look for some hair. Oh, wow, I can see loads of Emily in her now that I've done this. <laughs> okay, lots of Emily going on right now. That's probably quite similar to the way it's like looks in those pics, but is that just making her head look really long? I feel like it's making her head look really long. I, I don't love this hair, but I feel like it's this kind of vibes is where we should be at. Because I, I wanted to put like a little um, bandana thing on her head as well. So I need to work out like what styles. Oh, you can't see it with that one. The hair won't like let me put a bandana in it because it's too big. That looks so cool though. Okay, after trying on literally every hairstyle in the game, I keep coming back to this one. I don't know why, but I just keep going back to this one. So it has to be a sign that this is the right hair. I'm just gonna have to leave it with no hair piece, at least for now, because I can't get it to work. Oh, you've lost your earrings. It's the sailor outfit, which I kind of don't have. <laughs> so instead, this is gonna be hard. This is gonna be really hard. Little shorts, little shirt. I kind of like the dresses, like the dress that really goes out. Oh, gonna be hard. Let's see what I've got. I, I've just got so much CC and yet it's never enough. It's like real life clothes. You think you've got a wardrobe of clothes in it and then when it goes to find an outfit, you're like, I have nothing. All the ones that go out are like this. <laughs> They're like freaking huge. I don't really think that's what we're going for. That's too short. I don't feel like the style is short dresses. That kind of works. It's really long. It's too long, but it kind of works. It's kind of the right vibe, like the polka dots and stuff. That's the closest we've got so far. Ah. I think that's kind of close. I do kind of want to give her like, this sounds so wrong to say on Faith, but I feel like a chest piece really makes this look look like this look. However, can you see that it kind of like, now it looks more like the look. I think it looks like the look if I do that. Okay, I spent ages on this because what I really wanted was like roses on her chest because I feel like that's the vibe. <laughs> Unfortunately, no matter how hard I looked, I could not find roses on my tattoo list. I have so many tattoos, but I swear half the time they just don't appear. I don't know why. So we can't give her rose tattoos on her chest. I am very sorry, about that, I feel like it would have looked really cool, but it is not to be. So instead, let's just give it some nails. I'm thinking red nails would be looking pretty cute. Then some pretty shoes. I've got some in mind. I've got, uh, where are they at? These ones I thought were pretty cute. Oh, wow. They kind of broke her feet to get into them. So just look at them from the front. I mean, I could go for these ones instead. And I think we've got her little rockabilly style done. I like this on her. I think she looks really cute like that. You guys are going to have to let me know what you think in the comments below as well. I think I'm going to change out her earrings for black just to make them stand out a little bit more. And I'm going to go size her. And oh my gosh, this one is taken me so long. I hope I've done her justice. I hope she has that rockabilly look. If you guys dress like this yourselves, you'll be able to give me some guidance, but I think it's pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I'm gonna put like little posy shots of them all up at the end. So you'll be able to have like a proper compare and contrast, but I'm excited to go on to the final one because I don't know. I feel like we all want to see um, goth, goth faith. I feel like I've done something similar with this before where I gave her like um, a phoenixy kind of makeover, but I want to go like full on like black hair, the whole shebang, you know? Are we going eagle or are we going goth? I don't know. I don't know yet. 
I'm just gonna kind of make it up as I go along. I, I think that's a cute vibe. That's a really cute vibe there. That's a cute vibe as well. That is a cute vibe. I recognize her because of her eyebrows. She's on YouTube. I'm really struggling with this one. I'm gonna go for a slightly paler like skin tone as well. She's kind of looking a bit Harley Quinn, but I didn't mean to do that. I like this, this heavy makeup kind of freaks me out. Especially because like it's Faith. I'm, I'm just so not used to seeing her with like this kind of makeup at all. Yeah, like long straight hair. Her makeup, wild. Way darker than I've gone. I don't know, maybe I've gone too soft. I am too soft. Oh my gosh, she looks so different. I actually can't get over how different she looks. She does look cute though. She definitely looks cute. It's just really mm. different to what I, like, I don't know. She looks so different to how she normally does that my brain, like, my brain can't handle. My brain is confused.com. That is long hair, wow. Oh my, look at this hair then. <laughs> oh, she kind of looks like the girl from the ring. Oh, don't look, don't look. Kind of vibing snake vibes. Okay, that looks cool. Okay, dogs, dogs going crazy. Amazing, we always have to have the dogs wilding in a video. I feel like at this point, it's just a must. I know piercings aren't essential, but if they go, they go, you know? And then this is what I mean. All my chokers are like on the boys section. Let me knock off feminine. See if any of them pop up. Okay, I'm gonna give her this for now. Let's get her some clovies. Oh, no, let's get her some tattoos. Yes. So I'm gonna go for a full body one for this one. Like one that already has all of them on there. I downloaded loads for uh, Kai <laughs> and ended up finding loads more. If you haven't watched my story yet, you need to watch it because that'll make more sense. Okay, we got her some tattoos. Let's get her an outfit. Now, I don't... I actually think I have many gothic -y clothes. But I'll try and see what I can do. Something like this would be cute because I have socks like that. I don't even know what I got. Oh, I got these for Eve. Some of them would actually low-key kind of work, let's face it. I've got Bean here to help me out. Look at her little cutie face. So baby. I mean, that would work, but I, I want to do the outfit with the tights and stuff. I think that'll be more cute. This just, like, this is so right, but it, like, what's the point of me putting all the tattoos on her if I'm just going <laughs> to cover them all up, you know? Although that definitely works. Okay, <laughs> keep that one in mind. Lexi, stop wilding. Because something like this might work a little bit better, you know? Just so that we can see a bit more of her. These boots, again, love those. Uh, I just like boots, you know? I like these boots as well. But I think for her, the high boots worked better, I think. I don't know, what are you ladies wearing? Why are you not showing me? Oh, it's like the, almost like those like cloggy, thick shoe things, isn't it? No, I'm not so sure. Oh, fishnet tights underneath as well. That's a good idea. Why are your feet like that? Why are your feet like so tiny? Please grow your feet out. I don't know why Faith's feet were like size two. So I got those kind of tights as well. Oh, I don't know. So many options. It's confusing and hard. Okay, after much to and fro in, I went for this look in the end, just because I love those boots and I thought these tights were pretty cool. I've put like a little like, um, what's the right? Right word when it's like fabricy, but it's like see-through. Um, I can't think of what the word is, but like netty kind of thing across her shoulders because I thought that looked quite cool. And yeah, this is gothic. Faith. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Ah. So we've got goth Faith uh, with her light skin tone and her dark hair. We've got a rockabilly kind of pinup style Faith with blonde hair and with tunnels. We've got a Instagram body style Faith with a very bronzed look and a kind of darker red hair, but we kept the red hair for this one. And then we've got actual no makeup kind of vibes Faith with casual cute vibes and like this is Faith. This to me is so Faith Dickens. Like I can even even, like take off the tiny flicks I put on her eyes. I put them there just because they made her eyes look really big. But like she still looks super cute with no makeup on. Um, and yeah, these are the other versions of her. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Did I get, do a good job with all the looks? And which one is your favorite of her new looks? I have to say, I think this. I think this really suits her. I kind of want a sim that looks like this now, like this kind of rockabilly modern pinup vibes. I think that looks really, really cute. However, I think overall, regular Faith is my favorite Faith. The OG is still my favorite, but what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And I've tagged you guys to do this challenge as well. So if you have The Sims and if you can take screenshots, please go ahead and share them with me on Instagram with Claire Callery or on Twitter with Claire Siobhan. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a big cheeky thumbs up and I'll see you guys in another cast Monday. Bye.